Come on. Come on. Show everybody how you can crawl. Come on. Hi. Do you guys see Marlo under here? Um, I know a lot of you are probably like, oh my gosh, she has a dog. Well, Marlo likes to hide under the couch. She hides under there whenever the kids are home because she doesn't like the kids to bother her. She's super nice, like never heard a fly. But You're such a big boy. <laughs> I got this outfit for him. Really, Arf? I got this outfit for cash at Old Navy for 97 cents. And I'm sorry for my voice, but I am kind of sick and I have a really hoarse voice, don't I? But yeah, can you believe I got this for 97 cents? That's crazy. It's almost Cash's nap time. All right, y'all, I am, turn down this air back here. There's like nobody back here. And it's, anyways. Good morning, or almost afternoon. I don't have much of a voice today, so cool. Um, I've had a ridiculous cough for like four days now, and I think that's why my voice is almost gone because I've been tearing up my throat, coughing for four days straight. So yeah, I hope I can get to the end of this video with a uh, voice left over. And um, what is this guy? What you doing, buddy? Anyways. I'm in the Home Depot parking lot, and uh, he's like staring at me like, oh, bro. yeah, I know, touche, man. You were being weird, but I'm being weird because I'm talking to I, oh, why, is, why does everybody want to come to their car when I'm talking to my camera? Can't you guys come to your car when I'm not? Like this dude right here next to me? Awkward. Well, I try to park in places where there's not a lot of people, and then once I turn on the camera, everybody flocks to my direction. It's bizarre. Anyways, um, I am feeling really salty today. I don't know why. Like, I just, I'm just irritated. I didn't wake up like that. I just all of a sudden am like irritated with people and I know that that's not a good, a good way to be. Um, I'm gonna try, maybe I should get a, get a coffee and chill out or something. And I feel like my day gets wasted like it's already noon and I feel like I haven't accomplished anything and it makes me like it puts me in a bad mood so instead of sitting here and talking to the camera I'm gonna go into Home Depot see if they have the hardware that I want for my cabinets because as on my to-do list I have a to-do list a mile long and I need to get stuff done the last Home Depot that I went to was out of it so hopefully they have enough for me I need like one two three four five six I think yeah, so let's run in here and see if they have it, and then um, I'm gonna be on to my next thing. I gotta get stuff done. I'm kidless right now. Boys, older two are at school, and Cash is at home with Jeff, who is working from home, and Cash was napping, so I jolted out of there. So let's go. But uh, yeah, let's fix that. Ugh. But I did get the cabinet pulls that I needed. Um, oh my gosh, my voice is awful. Awful. Um, so yeah, I was really smart and well, when I got in there at first I was like, oh my gosh, I don't remember which cabinet pulls they were because I had bought them for my top cabinets and then I waited like a year before I did my bottom cabinets, but I took a picture of them like the exact skew when I bought them the first time because I knew that I was gonna come back and get more so I got six pools hallelujah so I'm gonna put those on my cabinets later um, now I need to go to Target we need um, <coughs> I guess I could go to HEB but Target's like way funner <sighs> I don't know should I go to Target or HEB is this even a real question so Hobby Lobby is not exactly on my to-do list today, but it is right by Target and I'm gonna run in here and see if they have some throw pillows on sale because my kids got chocolate milk all over my throw pillows and I can't get it out and I'm just gonna see. See what they got. 
See what I'm saying? Every time I pull out the camera, people come in their cars. I think I'm gonna get those. Okay, so now I found those, which look like the ones that I have. <coughs> but I like those too. <clears throat> I'm trying the maple pecan today. your day Mama, what how was your day can you hold my hand okay careful watch your step what she bought you oh choo choo you hear the choo choo yeah I know, pumpkins. Look, Mama. Look. Hey, Mama. Hey. There's a pumpkin patch at his school, so I figured I'd let him walk around. Hi, pumpkins. Bye -bye. Hi. <laughs> what you think? What are those? Flowers. Orange? Is that orange? Yeah? And that's not blue, that's orange. No. Oh, that's kind of blue. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. Look how pretty this pumpkin is. This is a real pumpkin. It looks fake. It's so pretty. Isn't that pretty? While I'm slowly heading back to my apartment I'm not You wanna sit on the tractor? I'm just thinking out loud in the darkness Woohoo! Look at Cooper! There's no point cause we Oh, you're gonna kiss the camera? Oh, you're so cute! Bye bye, Badger!
You're so ticklish. <laughs> Today, yes, you are. <laughs> Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Go. Oh, come on, do that bump it on the thingy. What? <laughs> do it. <laughs> oh, <my> gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, you're pulling my hair. No, don't eat my face. <laughs> <sighs> okay, so these are the pillows that I ended up getting when I was at Hobby Lobby today. Um, the pillows are half off, so these are only $15, which is really good for a pillow of this size. This is a 20 by 20. So I got two of them for 30 bucks such a good deal um, these are the pills that I had and I know that they're really similar but look how stained they are and the problem with these is that and I, I didn't think this through when I got these at Target but look this is just chocolate milk um, and this is kool-aid um, and I, yeah normally my kids are not supposed to drink in the living room they know this but somehow it happens and I've tried to wash these like I threw the whole thing in the washer and they, it's just not coming out like I've tried um, stain remover and all that like they're just, it's just not coming out so before I decide to just chunk them I think I'm gonna try one more time to get the stains out if I can I'll like put them on my bed or something um, but the, this one is the same way like they're just they're really bad um, and they're gorgeous pillows I love them but I should have got ones that unzipped um, cause that's how I normally wash all of my stuff. I just unzip it and take it off. So these, thank goodness, have a zipper. It's on my to-do list to like clean the, um, couches and stuff. So I, I can't talk today. Uh, to clean the couch cover, whatever. So see how stained this is over here and dirty? Thankfully, you can just take it off and clean it. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do right now. And then just clean all this up. So it's about five o'clock or so and you're gonna have to excuse my hair because I've been like rolling around on the floor with the kids as you guys probably saw and then just the wind and everything just yeah this is what I look like by five o'clock. Jeff went to go get Sydney. We don't normally have her on Wednesdays but we didn't have her on Monday and so um, we're gonna get her tonight. So we'll have all the kids tonight, but thankfully Jeff is home. I know that last time I was vlogging, I had mentioned that my general practitioner referred me to um, a GI specialist, and I have never been to a GI doctor. So I went the other day, and thankfully he was like so nice. I'm just like a consultation, and we just kind of talked, and I told him like my symptoms and stuff like that, and then um, he decided that it would probably be a good idea for me to do a colonoscopy. So we did schedule that. Um, I'm kind of on the fence about it. He thinks it will be good for me um, to have like a peace of mind and for him as well uh, because he couldn't exactly say like this is what it is without looking. So if you guys have ever had a colonoscopy, I would love to know what your experience was. Um, I'm not too concerned about it. I, when I was in clinicals, um, as a nurse, I spent some time on a, like a GI floor in one of the hospitals. And so I saw a lot of colonoscopies and, um, they were not very pleasant to watch. Honestly, I wish that I had never seen that because 
now I know like from a bystander what it looks like and it's not awesome. But if you've been through it before, I have talked to, um, with a few people on Instagram who have gone through it before and they say it's no big deal. Um, they will be putting me to sleep, I think. Um, so that's good because I don't want to be awake or remember any of it. I've heard horror stories about people like waking up in the middle of it, which is kind of scary. So um, if you guys have had a colonoscopy before let me know is it no big deal um i'm like i said i'm not really worried about it but i like to hear other people's experiences and i don't know i'm still on the fence about getting one like he says he thinks he knows what it is but he can't be for sure without looking and so for peace of mind for both of us he recommends that i do this so it's really kind of just up to me um and Jeff as well, I guess, what we decide to do. So anyways, I'll keep you guys updated on that. Um, it's supposed to be scheduled for the very beginning of November. So I do have one scheduled. It just kind of depends on whether or not I chicken out or not and <laughs> cancel it. So anyways, that's what's going on in my life. Nothing like a little colonoscopy talk for you to get a little bit personal. But where are you going tomorrow? You're going to the zoo? Show me what's on, show them what's on your, your shirt. Look at that. I got this from Old Navy. It was on sale for $8. And I thought, my little Carter would like that because he likes animals. So tomorrow they're going on a field trip to the zoo. What's your favorite animal that you're looking forward to seeing tomorrow? What's your favorite animal to see at the zoo? You got two. What are they? Cheetah. A cheetah? And Why do you like cheetahs? Because they're fast. Because they run fast? Are they the fastest animal in the world? Yes. And tigers? Yeah. Why do you like tigers? Oh, another tiger! <laughs> I know you like tigers. That's why I always buy you stuff with tigers on it. <laughs> Alright, so I am ending the vlog the next day. I am sorry. Um, last night just kind of got away from me. The last time I picked up the camera was like 5 o'clock in the evening. And then we had all the kids and it was like bath time, dinner time, bedtime, and then I had to run to the store and grab some things that I forgot earlier in the day that we needed for the kids' lunches and stuff. So I'm sitting outside because it actually feels like fall and it feels so good out here. I could just, I could spend all day out here. It feels so good. It's probably like 70 degrees out here, which is like for Texas is big. So, and last night I didn't get hardly any sleep. I probably got about three hours. I was up coughing all night long. Literally the last time I looked at the clock was 2.30 and I, was, I had still not fallen asleep at all. And then I had to get up at six to take the kids to school. So I probably got about three hours of sleep. Um, but I'm feeling pretty good despite the fact that I got no sleep last night, surprisingly. So I hope to tackle some more stuff on my to-do list today. But I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new and I will see you guys on my next vlog. Bye.